Meet Bailey, my four-legged furry best friend. I couldn't wait to spend my whole spring break in the company of Bailey, but things don't always turn out the way we planned, leading to a sad and empty spring break. Bailey was born right on our farm by our first dog, Lily. She was one of six puppies. I begged and begged my mom and dad to let us keep just one. I mean, look at this little furball. How could my parents say no? Instantly, Bailey and I just clicked. She was a playful puppy. She listened to directions very well. We had her potty trained, and she could herd the cattle and played fetch better than any dog I know. Then it was time for me to say goodbye to Bailey when I went to college. I would now be two hours away from my puppy. When I came home for Christmas, I was able to see my best pal again. We even got into the Christmas spirit. Little did I know, this would be the last time I would see her. It was a normal Thursday morning when I got a phone call from my mom. She then told me nobody had seen Bailey since yesterday morning, which had seemed really odd. Bailey was an outdoor dog, but usually spent most of her days laying in our yard with her mom, Lily, or out with the cows in the pasture. She has never ran off our property before, and there's no signs that she had been hit by a car. We tried to get the news out about my missing dog by post on social media. The town's Facebook page even wrote about her going missing. Perks of a small town. We found out later that week the neighbor's dog up the gravel road had also gone missing. A week after being home all week for spring break and missing out on time with Bailey, I got a phone call that flipped everything around. Bailey was found. We got a call that she was spotted 15 miles away from our house with the neighbor's dog. Seems a little bit sketchy, and questions swarmed about what happened to Bailey. How did she get there? Did someone take her? Why did they leave her? Who steals dogs? I'm trying to put it all behind me now that she is found, and I'm counting down the days until I can give her a big kiss at last.